Welcome to the Madison Miller Podcast. Today is Wednesday, August 7th, 2024. We'll go over the Olympics results from yesterday and this morning. We've got everything going on today. We'll do baseball, soccer, PGA, news and notes, and best bet. We'll start the Olympics um, like we've been doing since Monday. We'll go over the result of everything you look ahead to, what's going on today, and results for today. Um, all right, so men's basketball yesterday. Germany over Greece, 76 to 63. Serbia over Australia, 95 90. France over Canada, 82 73. U.S. over Brazil, 122 87. Soccer, the semifinals, U.S. over Germany, 1 0. Brazil over Spain, 4 2. Athletics, women's 200 meter final, U.S. Um, Ga- Ga- uh, Gabrielle Thomas gets the gold, silver, um, Julian. Alfred of St. Lucia, bronze, Brittany Brown of U.S. The 3,000 meter steeplechase final. Your goal going to um, Winfred Yavi of Brene, silver, Peruth, Tamati. of Uruguay, Rogaga, and bronze going to Kenya's Faith Cheritich. The men's 1,500-meter final, the gold going to Cole Hawker of U.S. Great Britain's Josh Kerr gets silver, and bronze going to Yared Nasuge of U.S. Men's long jump final, the gold going to Greece's Matildas Tengolu. Silver, Jamaica's Wayne Pinnock, and the bronze going to Italy's Mattia Ferlaini. Women's hammer throw final, the gold going to Cameron Rogers of Canada. Silver, um, Annette Akumake of U.S., and the bronze going to Zhou Ji of China. Boxing, um, women's 60 kg final, uh, gold going to Ireland's Kelly Harrington. Silver, China's Yang Wen Lu. The women's, um... 66 kg semifinal. The gold going or the um first going to Yang Liu of China and then the bronze going to Chinese Tepe's Chen then Chin. And the other semifinal or she'll be playing for the bronze. Um so going to the gold game um or match um Algeria's Iman Khalif and then um, the runner-up tie lands on Junjim Swanapeng. The women's KG semifinal, um, going to the gold medal game, um, Turkey's Boost Nas Kakralu. In the bronze medal game, um, Philippines' is Ira Villegas. Um, the women's 50 KG semifinal, the, um, going to the gold medal game, China's Wu Yu. And then, um, going for the bronze, um, Nazim Kazabi of Kazakhstan. The men's 71 kg semifinal, um, getting the win here was, um, Mexico's Marco Alonso Verde Alvarez over Great Britain's Lewis Richardson. And then the other semifinal, the men's 71 kg Winning that one was Uzbek- Uzbekistan's um, Asadkuja Mudkanjaev over U.S.'s Omari Jones. Cycling track, the goal going to the Netherlands. Um, Roy Vandenberg, Harry Leverson, and Jeffrey Hooglin over Great Britain's Ed Lowe, Hamish Turnbull, and Jack Carlin. They get the silver. In the bronze race, some um, Australia's Matthew Glater, Lee Hoffman, and Matthew Richardson gets that over France's Florian Gregbo, Sebastian Vigier, and Rayon Halal. Diving, the women's 10 meter platform final, the gold going to China's Quan Hong Chang, the silver, 
China's Chen Yixi, and LeBron's going to Kim Mi Rae of North Korea. Equestrian, the jumping individual final, the gold going to Germany's Christian Kukuk, the silver going to Switzerland's Steve Gordet, and the bronze going to the Netherlands' is Michael van der Vilten. A lot of wrestling stuff to go over. Um, women's 68 kg freestyle gold medal match. Um, the gold going to Amit Allure over Marim Zuman Zavora. Of um, Kyrgyzstan. Um, the gold for the men's 130kg Greco Roman, Cuba's um, Mijane Lopez over Gisami Acosta Fernandez of Chile. Mixed uh, men's 60kg Greco Roman gold medal match. Um, the goal going to Japan's Kinakiro Fumita over China's Kao Ligo. Women's 68 kg freestyle bronze medal match. Um, Japan's Nanoka Ozeki over Nigeria's Blessing Oberudu. And then the other... Um, Bronze medal match for the 68 kg. Turkey's um, Boos Kavasoglu Tosun over North Korea's Pak Solgum. Men's 30 k 130 kg Greco Roman bronze medal match. China's Meng Lingzi over Egypt's Abdaliyev Mohammed. In the other bronze medal match in Men's 130kg, um, going to Iran's Amin Mizaradeth over, um, Sabah Saleh Shariati of Azerbaijan. The men's 60kg Greco-Roman bronze medal matches, um, North Korea's Risa Young over Venezuela's Raber Jose Rodriguez Orozo and... Um, Zolomon Sharshmavov over Iran's Mini Monson Najad. And the winner, by the way, is from, um, Kyrgyzstan. And in skateboarding from yesterday, the gold going to Australia's Risa True, Silver Japan's Kokona Haraki, and the bronze going to Sky Brown of Great Britain. Results so far for today, women's basketball, Australia over Serbia, 85-67. Right now going on, Belgium and Spain. Belgium has a 22-point lead as we speak. Still to come today. Um, so, France, Germany, and Nigeria, U.S. So, I'm going to quickly um, pull up the lines For the two games. So France is giving five and a half. Total is 136 and a half on the women's side. Um, that game's on at noon. Um, I'm going to go with the over. That's a low total. And then Nigeria, U.S. U.S. is giving a whopping 28 and a half. Total is 156 and a half. I'm going to go over in that game as well. So also today, um, artistic swimming team acrobatic routine. Athletics, we have... The men's 3,000 meter steeplechase final, the men's 400 meter final, the men's discus throw final, the women's pole vault final, and then we have one result the mixed marathon race walk final. The gold going to Alvaro Martin and Maria Perez of Spain, the silver, Ecuador's Brian Daniel Pintado and Glenda Morgan, bronze, Australia's Ryan Cowley and Jamima Montag. Boxing today, the men's 80 kg final, the men's 63 and a half kg final, the men's semifinals, the uh, over 92 kg, and then we have the semifinals for the women's 57 kg.
Um, then cycling track, we have the both men's and women's team pursue finals, gold and bronze medal races. Sailing, we have a final, the women's dinghy medal race, the gold going to the Dutch's Marine Baumeister, silver Denmark's Anne Marie Rindum, bronze Norway's Lynn Flemhost. The men's dinghy medal race is today as well as the mixed dinghy medal race. And then the mixed multi-hill medal race is today too. Skateboarding, we have the men's park final. Sport climbing, the women's speed final took place. Um, gold going to Poland's Alexandra Murslov, silver China's Deng Lijuan, and the bronze Poland's Alexandra Kaluka. Taekwondo, um, we have the men's 58 kg gold medal, women's 49 kg gold medal, the men's 58 kg bronze medal contests, as well as the women's 49 kg bronze medal contests. Um, weightlifting, we have the women's 49 kg final and the men's 61 kg final. Wrestling, we have a lot today, too. Um, the women's 50 kg freestyle. Um, the bronze medal matches and the gold medal match. The men's 97 kg wrestling, Greco Roman. We have the gold medal match and the bronze medal matches. And then we have the men's 77 kg Greco Roman gold medal match and the bronze medal matches. So there you have it for Olympics for today. Now I'll move on to baseball. Um, we'll go over the results from yesterday. And we have a very busy day today with a lot of rainouts from yesterday. So the two rainouts today that now have doubleheaders today is Angels, Yankees, and D-backs, Guardians. Other results, Reds over to Marlins 8-2, Padres over to Pirates 6-0, Nats over to Giants 11-5, Jays over to Orioles 5-2 is the best bet lost, Brewers over to Braves 10-0, Cardinals over to Rays 4-3, Astros over to Rangers 4-2, Cubs over to Twins 7-3. Could have went back to the well for best bet there. Um, Red Sox over to Royals 6-5, Rockies over to Mets 6-3, so that was a, my other option for best bet lost. Um. White Sox end their 21-game losing streak with a 5-1 win at the Athletics. You knew it was probably going to be against Oakland because Oakland is not good enough. Or you knew that team, Oakland, that was the White Sox' best chance. Tigers over to Mariners 4-2 and the Phillies over to Dodgers 6-2. All right, first game today, 1 o'clock. You have doubleheader game one, Diamondbacks-Guardians. Brandon Fott and Ben Lively. Um, Guardians minus 116. D-backs minus 102. Over under 7F. Overs minus 122. Under is even money. D-backs minus 1F plus 58. Guardians plus 1F is minus 92. Um, hmm. That's a good one. I just don't like Brandon Fott. So I'm going to go with the... Guardians at minus 116. 220 Twins Cubs. Joe Ryan and Javier Assad. Um, the Twins are minus 136. The Cubs are plus 116 over under 7. Overs minus 115. Unders minus 105. Twins minus 1F plus 122. Cubs plus 1F is minus 46. Um, tough one. But I'm going to go with the over again. Also, at 2.30 on MLB Network, Astros, Rangers, Yusei Kikuchi, and Jose Arena. Astros minus 132, Rangers plus 112, over on their 9. Overs minus 105, others minus 115. Astros minus 1 half, plus 118, Rangers plus 1 half is minus 42. I'm going with the Rangers plus 112. I'm not a Kikuchi fan, as you guys know. White Sox, A's, 330. Um, Dave Martin or Davis Martin and Joey Estes. A's minus 190. White Sox plus 160 over under 8.5. Overs minus 112. Unders minus 108. White Sox plus 1.5 is minus 26. A's minus 1.5 plus 105. Tough one. Over. Um, 4 o'clock. Angels, Yankees, game 1. 
Davis Daniel and Luis Heal. Yanks minus 290, Angels plus 235, over under 8.5, overs minus 105, unders minus 115. Angels plus 1.5 is plus 114, Yankees minus 1.5 is minus 137. Um, that's a little bit of a hard one. I'm going to go with the under for the first game of the doubleheader only because um, I could see the Yankee offense being a little rusty and they win maybe 5-1 in the first game or something like that, 5-2. Um, and a doubleheader game two, D-backs, Guardians. Eduardo Rodriguez making a season debut against Carlos Carrasco. D-backs minus 118. Guardians even money over under 8. Overs minus 105. Unders minus 115. D-backs minus 1.5 plus 46. Guardians plus 1.5 is minus 76. I'm going to go with the Diamondbacks minus 118. Edrod's back. Um, 640 Reds Marlins. Andrew Rabbit and Valente Beloso. Um, Reds minus 130. Marlins plus 110. Over under 8.5. Overs minus 105. Unders minus 115. Reds minus 1.5 plus 26. Marlins plus 1.5 is... Minus 152. Um, don't feel good about it, but the over. Fox Sports 1, Padres Pirates, Michael King, and Marco Gonzalez. Padres minus 154, Pittsburgh plus 130, over under 8. Overs minus 105, unders minus 115. Padres minus 1.5 plus 104. Pirates plus 1.5 is minus 22. I'm going to go with the under, but I don't feel good about it. Giants, Nats, 645, Blake Snell, and Jake Irvin. Giants minus 158. Nats plus 134 over under 7.5. Overs minus 115. Others minus 105. Giants minus 1.5 is even money. Nats plus 1.5 is minus 120. I want to take the Nationals at plus 134 because this I could see being a letdown for Blake Snell after the no-hitter. Um, 7 o'clock. Prime video. Angels, Yankees. Game 2. Carson Fulmer, Will Warren. Yanks minus 240, Angels plus 198, over under 8.5. Overs minus 120, unders minus 102. Angels plus 1.5 is even money, Yankees minus 1.5 is minus 120. Um, I'm going to go over 5.5, Yankee rounds plus 118. This is where I think the Yankee offense will do some damage. Um, O's Blue Jays. Trevor Rogers, Bowden Francis. O's minus 138, Jays plus 118, over under 9.5, over receiving money, unders minus 122. O's minus 1.5 plus 112, Jays plus 1.5 is minus 34. I like the over, but no, it's not going to be best bet. 720, Brewers, Braves, Fred Peralta, the Chris Sale. Braves minus 164, Brewers plus 138, over under 8, over minus 108, unders minus 112. Brewers plus 1.5 is minus 162, Braves minus 1.5 plus 134. I like the under. 745, race cards. Taj Bradley, Eric Feed. Um, cards minus 122, Rays plus 104, under 7.5. Overs minus 105, unders minus 115. Rays plus 1.5 is minus 10, cards minus 1.5 plus 176. Um, 10. Um, tough one, but I'm going to go with the Rays at plus 104. 8 o'clock, Red Sox Royals. Cutter Crawford and Cole Reagans. Royals minus 144, Red Sox plus 122, over under 8.5, minus 10 each way. Red Sox plus 1.5 is minus 66, Royals minus 1.5 plus 138. Um, tough one, but I'm going to go to the over. 8.30, Mets Rockies, Paul Blackburn and Ryan Feltner. Um, Mets minus 154, Rockies plus 130, over under 11, overs minus 4, and there's minus 118. Mets minus 1.5, minus 104. Rockies plus 1.5 is minus 115. I like the under. 9.30 MLB Network, Tigers, Mariners. Tariq Skubal, George Kirby. Mariners minus 132. Tigers plus 112 over under 6. Minus 10 each way. Tigers plus 1.5 is minus 205. Mariners minus 1.5 plus 172. 6. That's unreal. That's the lowest total I've ever seen in a game. But... I can't go under. I'm going to go with the Tigers at plus 112 with the ace on the bump and two, uh, school ball. 10 o'clock, Phillies, Dodgers. Tyler Phillips and Gavin Stone. Um, Dodgers minus 142. Phillies plus 120 over under 9. Overs minus 106. Unders minus 114. Phillies plus 1.5 is minus 72. Dodgers minus 1.5 plus 142. Um, 
I'm going to go with the under because I think that's a high total. All right, now move on to soccer. Um, we'll go over the results from yesterday. If no, look at a little to today. So we'll start with League's Cup. So last day of group phase was yesterday. New England and Nashville was 1-1 draw, but New England won 5-4 on penalties. So, um, now you move on to the round of 32. Um, two games tonight. They're both late. The first one is Vancouver Unam. Um, I'm just gonna pull this up. Um, Vancouver plus one thirty-five, Unam plus one sixty-five, draw plus two forty. Go with Vancouver plus one thirty-five, and then LAFC Austin, LAFC minus three thirty, Austin six to one, the draws plus four thirty. LAFC is winning this game. We're going to go over three and a half goals, minus 106. UCL qualifying. Um, Ludogorets over FK Karabag, 2 1. Malmo Payok, 2 2 draw. Magiland over Fern Carvos, 2 0. Dynamo Rangers, 1 1 draw. Sparta, Sparta FCSB, 1 1 draw. Lily over Fenerbahce, 2 1. RB Salzburg over SC, 22 1. This is obviously Champions League qualifying. Um, so we only have three um, UEFA qualifying games today. One o'clock, you have Slavia Pargu and Union SG. Um, let's see if we have... Yeah, we do have... Um, the qualifying games. Slavia minus one fifteen. Union SG plus two eighty. Drop plus two thirty. I'm going with um Pergu at minus one fifteen. Two thirty. Um, South Braslava and Apol. Um, or Slovan. Slovan plus one five. Apol plus two forty. Drop plus two ten. I'm going with Slovan plus 105, and then 245 is Jagalonia and Bodo Glimt. Jagalonia plus 170, Bodo plus 125, drop plus 50. I'm going to go with Bodo at plus 125. And we have a lot of club friendlies. Today, um, we had some yesterday, too. So, AS Roma over Barnsley, 4-0. Dortmund, Villarreal, 2-2 draw. Real Madrid over Chelsea, 2-1. And Barcelona, Milan, 2-2 draw. And then Milan won 4-3 on penalties. And then we have a final from this morning. Athletic over Kitche, 6-1. At noon, we have Paris FC and UNFP. 12-30, from Sturm, Sturm Graz and PSG. 1 o'clock, Arsenal, Leverkusen. Arsenal, minus 5 Leverkusen, plus... 215 draw plus 2 and going Arsenal minus 105. Near 2 o'clock, you have Lazio Southampton. Lazio plus 155 Southampton plus 145 draw plus 250. I'm going to go with the draw plus 250. 230 on ESPN, the Port Days, Cadiz Batiste. Batiste minus 120, Cadiz plus 260, draw plus 230. I'm going to go over 2.5 goals minus 115. And 230, you have Inter and Al Hidiad. So that's a lot of soccer for today. Now move on to PGA. Um, the PGA is back after their Olympic run. Scotty Scheffler, of course, getting the gold medal there. Um, so the last tournament we had was the 3M Open. And then, then they had the Olympics. And then they had the Open. And then the ISCO. And the Scottish Open. 
John Deere Classic. So those are the ones that happen between my hiatus and now. So when the champion, um, championship, it all starts tomorrow morning. Um, 6.50, Ben Coles, Mavic Dilley, Davis Lipsky, Rio Hisatune, Tyson Alexander, Justin Sue, 7.01, Matthew Neesmith, Will Gordon, Scott Stevens, Dylan McCarthy, Bill Haas, Roger Sloan, 7.12, Max Graceman, Victor Perez, Nicholas Hojard, Nate Lashley, Dylan Wu, Patrick Rogers, Will Zalatoris, you know, Zal- 7.23, with Justin Rose, Jordan Spieth, Adam Putnam, Gyeonggu Lee, and... Raul Pareda. 7.34. Um, J.B. Holmes, Shane Lowry, Victor Norman, Sanjay Mashke Bahita, and Matt Wallace. 7.45. Um, J.T. Potson, Daniel Berger, Kevin Kisner, Harry English, Brendan Todd, and Cam Young. 7.56. Kirk Tatayama, Cam Davis, Lucas Hodges, Austin Eckroat, Chris Goderip and Evan Van Royen. 8.07. Um, Brant Snecker. Um, Gary Woodland, Webb Simpson, Matt Kuchar, Emiliano Grio, and Davis Thompson. 8.18. Eric Cole, Vincent Willie, Kevin Stroman, Vio Hassler, Michael Kim, Jason Hadley. 8.29. Henrik Norlander, Wesley Bryant, Doug Gim, Ben Griffin, Carson Young, Callum Tarrant. 8.40. Ryan Fox, um, S.H. Kim, Chom Kim, Grayson Sieg, um, Mac Meisner, and Alex Baddeley. 851, Paul Bargen. Um, that's really it of no in that window. 902. Um, Harry Springer. Um, Parker Cootie, Trevor Whitney, and Ori Campillo. All right, 12 10. Pat Zier, Zach Blair, Ryan Moore, Troy Merritt, Joseph Burlett, Matt Trainer. 12 1, Aaron Wright, Ben Taylor, Andrew Novak, Grayson Higo, Christian Zedenhout. 12 32, Min Woo Lee, um, Chandler Phillips, Thomas Dietrich, Brandon Wu, Adam Hadwin. 12 43, JJ Spawn. Robert McIntyre, Nick Hardy, Bryce Garnett, Brett Horschel, Brian Harmon, 1254, Keegan Bradley, Mackenzie Hughes, um, Peter Mulnati, Lucas Glover, S.W. Kim, Robert Brem, 105, Chad Ramey, Nicholas Ecovrio, Davis Riley, Nick Dunlap, Stuart St. Jonathan Vegas, 116, Stefan Yeager, Adam Shank, Nick or Nate Taylor, Chesar V, Luke Lisk, Vegas. 127, Seamus Power Camp Champ, Taylor Warren, Harry Hall, Adam Swepson, Jack Johnson. 138, Joel Dahman, Yuchen Yuan, Matthias Schmidt, Hayden Buckley, Keith Mitchell, Joaquin Herman. 149, Mark Hubbard, Alex Molly, Sam Ryder, C.T. Pond, Martin Laird, and Bud Cawley. 2 o'clock, Justin Lauer, Paul Fishburne, Tyler Duncan, Charlie Hoffman. Um, 2.11, Ben Silverman, Trevor Crow. I'm just doing notables now. 2.22, Pearson Cootie, Kevin Doherty, and Adrian DeMonte Chazard. All right, this is from Sedgefield Country Club. In North Carolina, in Greensboro. Um, last year, Lucas Glover won the event. Um, in 22, it was Tom Kim. In 21, it was Kevin Kisner. Did they have it in 20 during COVID? Yes, it was Joaquin Herman. 19 was JT Potts and um so there's a couple guys I'm considering for this event. This is like one of your throw your darts events here. Um
Justin Rose's 70 to 1 is intriguing. So is Jordan Speeth at 35 to 1. Those are good opportunities for those guys. JT Potts in 65, the one's a good number. Um, so I'm going to go, I'm going to go with the safe bet. I'm going to go with Jordan Spieth at 35, the one to win the Wyndham. Okay, now move on to the news and notes for today. Very busy in news and notes. Um, so, um, um, Framber Valdez nearly had a no-hitter last night. Two outs, bottom of the ninth, and Corey Seager gets a two-run shot. Oh, well. They almost had their second no-hitter of the year, the Astros. There will be an MLB game at a NASCAR track in 2025 at Bristol between the Braves and the Reds. And now the question is, who's going to be the home team there? It's probably going to be Cincinnati. That would make the most sense. Um, but it could end up being uh, Atlanta. But who's going to give up the home game for the game at Bristol? I think that's an interesting... Um, twerk for baseball? We've seen college football be played there. I vaguely remember it was like Tennessee, Virginia Tech. So now we're going to see baseball on an NASCAR track. Which is um, pretty cool. Um, so, coming down from Ian Rappaport right now as we speak... Um, the NFL confirmed that the Lions and the Giants organizations have each been fined two hundred grand for multiple fights that broke out that joint practices between the clubs. All clubs were reminded in a memo sent last month that fighting and unprofessional conduct and joint practices would not be tolerated. That's not ideal for either of those organizations. Um, so the Lori Marketing situation... Um, Uh, his deal is supposed to be worth over $200 million as his contract is projected to be a five-year deal. The price was too steep for the Warriors as the Jazz trade proposal was a bad deal, as they said, and then now they're exploring smaller-scale contracts after missing out on marketing. Um, The Jazz are linked to... Brandon Ingram, as Utah would likely need to include Walker Kessler in a deal. I thought this was going to be for marketing, which is, that's weird. Um, The Steelers, those reported, are still in on Brandon Ayuk, despite being reports that they were out. How about this? Christian McCaffrey in an interview had a slip. He called Brandon Ayuk a former teammate. Yikes. Not ideal. Or McCaffrey knows he's out. There was reported that the Patriots are willing to cash out Ayuk as they were open to make Brandon one of the top five highest paid receivers per year. And then it was reported the Patriots are out on talks as they're done exploring the trade possibilities and will focus on young guys. And then he was... Reported that he was uninterested in the Patriots. As I don't blame him. The Saints are hosting Justin Simmons today. So we'll see how that goes. That would be a nice addition for that defense. 2023 relationship between Jalen Hurts and Nick Sirianni described as fractured and unhealthy. Whoa. That's not great. Um... If this trickles into this season, then that's a troubling situation. Um, Bruce Thor Greaterall exits game with a hamstring injury. Eight pitches into his season debut as he was helped off. That's sad.
Mookie Betts may return next week as he plans to keep Otani in the leadoff spot and bat Mookie Betts second. Which I would flip the two guys. Kevin Durant became the Team USA's all-time leading scorer yesterday, which was pretty cool. Speaking of Christopher McCaffrey, he's likely out for the preseason. Due to the calf strain, he's missing several weeks of practice. So, the 49ers stuff, um, not ideal right now. Um, Puka Nachua will be ready for week one, as John McVay says that Nachua's knee injury is no threat to sideline him for season opener, which is good. Um, the Dodgers want Dalton rushing. To play left field as he'll exclusively be playing that position to begin time in triple A. Hmm. LeBron got stitches on his head as he exited in the third quarter after being hit in the near left eye against Brazil. It came out that Rudy Gobert had finger surgery as he suffered injury before knockout rounds. Um, that makes sense to why he hasn't played. And they're probably better without. Um, him. And then Mark and we talked about. They, they're extending him. And he won't be tradable. This upcoming season. Matarazzo rejects the U.S. men's national team job. As the Hoffenheim coach denies reports of the deal. Alvarez agrees to um, the Atleti move as he said for a five-year deal with um, Atleti. So that is a huge deal in soccer. Um, and Griezmann is in LAFC talks as he's um, nears the long-rumored MLS move. And then Pitbull Stadium, we talked about that a little bit yesterday. There's new vodka in the stadium. They must create an anthem. Those are some of the details. And then EA Sports is working with FIU to possibly get the uh, forthcoming update there. So there you have it for news and notes. Last but not least, my best bet of the day brought to you by FanDuel. Um... There's a couple interesting ones that I like. I'm only going to go with 100th of a unit on the pick. And I decided to go with... The over actually, no, I'm sorry, the under in the Brewers Braves game because Chris Sale's pitching. So, um, I trust Chris Sale to keep that low scoring, and I don't trust the Braves offense really right now. So I'm gonna lay a hundredth of a unit on under eight between the Brewers and the Braves for best bet. All right, so there you have it for the show. I'll be back tomorrow recapping everything, looking at everything tomorrow as well. We have NFL preseason games tomorrow. Which should be a lot of fun as well. Can't wait to bet on those. Hope you guys have a great day, everyone.